obvious that you guys adore and love each other, but it hasn't always been like that. Very true. When was your relationship tested the most? Well, we went through a stage where Rashawn cheated on me. And a lot of people would say that was to be expected because we've been together for so long. Mm -hmm. But to be honest with you, I didn't expect it because he treated me amazingly. Mm -hmm. A lot of times when people go through things like cheating, the man treats the woman poorly at home. Mm -hmm. yeah. right. But our sex life was good. He was always giving me compliments, mm -hmm. very generous. Mm -hmm. Everything was fantastic. He was a wonderful father. He never failed at that. I really didn't see any red signs. Wow. And when I found out, for me, I knew that it was gonna be over. Because my entire life being with him, that was my hard line. Yeah. That's mm -hmm. the line you don't cross. Yeah. So when I found out, I hired a divorce attorney. Mm -hmm. Wow. I even began to prep my kids. And it was so bad in our home. And it was very bad for him professionally. And it started to spill over into his work life. He couldn't perform, and as a radio personality. Yeah, you gotta be on. You yeah. gotta be on. Every day. It doesn't yeah. matter what, what you're on? going through. What was through. happening? Um, it was, it was, I was losing everything. You know, I'm losing this person that really held me down, was there mm -hmm. from the start, didn't care about money, didn't care about anything, just cared for my well-being. And then, my family. I, I felt like a letdown, I felt like a failure. Mm -hmm. And you know, like I was Rashawn at home, but in the streets I was DJ Envy. Mm -hmm. So right. it was two mm -hmm. different people. And I didn't know DJ Envy. Right. And it. It, was, it was a situation where I, I messed up, and I messed up completely. I couldn't do my work. I was at work sleeping. Like, it really affected me. Mm -hmm. And um, thank God for two people. One was Rashi, which is her best friend, and the other was Tyrese. What? Yeah, Tyrese. Tyrese Gibson? Tyrese? Tyrese Gibson. <laughs> That's like a random... <laughs> so we have to ask. Good old Tyrese. Help. So I, I apologized to my wife on air, and um, oh. I kind of embarrassed her. She had no clue, but at this point, I was trying everything to get her to listen. Because so up I... until that yeah. point, everything, every, all of his attempts had failed. Yeah. So that was his last attempt to try to do it publicly. Yes. But you have to think, nobody knew. It wasn't a public thing. Yeah. Yeah. At so that point, it was only between us. Yeah. Okay. So I knew, but then he outed it to the public. Yeah. Not with details, but the apology, yes. yeah. then all you had to do was read between the lines. So right. um, Tyrese heard it when I said it on air, and I didn't know Tyrese. I didn't have any, we didn't know each other, he didn't have my number. Yeah. We just professionally, I would see him, hey, what's up? And he called me, he said, I heard you on the radio and I wanna help. And I was like, but you don't know me. He was like, God gave me a sign to help you. So I was like, all right, Tyrese wants some spins or something. <laughs> <laughs> but he really said, I don't care, I don't care. I, I really wanna help. So he was like, this is what I want you to do. He says, I want you to book a reservation at this restaurant get the private room, I'm gonna come and I'm gonna sing and I'm gonna talk to y'all. So she, we, I booked the private room and Guy and I were having dinner and Tyrese came in singing with a backup singer what? and a, a guitarist, a guitarist Wait. singing Stay. And I didn't know Tyrese and he was singing. What? And he sang like he was singing at the Grammys. Like he was <laughs> <laughs> And you know that Tyrese face? Yes. He was, Wait, so hard. Yes. He was singing and. Ooh yeah. Ooh yeah. Ooh, yeah. yeah. And, and he sat down for um, four hours with us and just had conversations and pretty much was my angel. Every day until we were able to try to work it out and get, yeah. get me back in the house, well, not in the house, but get me back in at least her speaking graces. Yeah. He would talk to Gia four in the morning, five in the morning, midnight. He'd be on the phone for eight hours. Yeah, so. Wow. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Give it really up to Tyrese. Wow. Wow. Never did yeah. on Tyrese as well. All right, T. Wow.